I guess the blazes for this trail is just wood with FT sprayed on it for Falcon Trail. And so, either way, it's a pretty easy trail to keep up with. And so, we're going to be in the woods for a portion of this trail. And then we're going to see fields, big open fields, if I remember right. Um, really is nice. That's one good thing about, neat thing about this trail is it gives you different types of things to look at and so I know there's a school I think that's a school right up here and here's something I don't recall seeing last time oh this is cool I may have to have a sit down moment here and uh, do some stretching I think I'll wait on Sandra to catch up with me here and uh yeah have outdoor class here oh this is neat this would be a cool place to have a bible study at oh man yeah i'll wait on here for but yeah this is a this is a neat place here okay we're gonna have to go back because we are behind uh is it graystone graystone school and so on the map i'm going to show you where we're at this is the, about the general location of where we're at right now and see i'm looking at behind the school and that's not right evidently they got something going on here that they've added what we saw is we saw barriers that was keeping us from going where i thought the trail was would lead us and so I'm like, okay, maybe this is a section of the new trail. But then when I got to looking at the thread trail map I downloaded, um, I'm like, no, that's not right. And so what they should have done, and this may be just a temporary thing. Maybe it's something they got going on this weekend or something. I don't know. Uh, but they uh, should have put for Falcon Trail this way. And so, but... That's okay. It's still a beautiful area. I will say that. And uh, but it's just it's not the it's not the right trail that we're supposed to be on. Okay, this is where it split off at. If you'll notice this barrier here, if you guys ever come here and see this, just remember this. This right here is the Falcon Trail. It goes right on. That's the Falcon Trail. When I saw that, I'm going, well, there's the trail there. Well, since they added on to it, I ain't been out here since, so I didn't know. So I saw these arrows and stuff, and I saw this barrier here, and I figured, okay, well, maybe this is part of that new system, though it didn't seem to match what I had on the map. So that's what lesson number one, always follow the map. <laughs> so always follow the map. But at any rate, we, walk, we didn't walk really that far maybe a half a mile and um and then i said something ain't right and then that's when we found out but this right here is the falcon trail right there that's the falcon trail and so this right here is if you'll notice on the map this is where i believe we are at and and so um now we had something else happen um now sandra's parked at the park richfield park and when we get done with the hike we're gonna to have to double back and then she's we're gonna get in her car and go back to where i'm parked at at the beginning of the trailhead well she forgot her keys and so we don't have any keys to get in her car and so luckily for us though my son is working today and he's a police officer for um meisenheimer or the uh, pfeiffer university and so what we're going to do is call him up and have him come pick up Sandra and then take her to the um, where our car is where and car is. where my car is, get, get the keys for her car and then um, bring her back. And then we're going to continue on on the trail. And so, but if it wasn't for that, We'd probably be looking at about 10 and a half to 11 miles, seeing all the backtracking we've had to do already. And so, um, which I've done before. And so it's, 
I was ready to do it. And so, but since we have that as a backup, because I didn't come prepared here to do a 10 and a half, 11 mile. And so I would have brought my stove and some dehydrated food. See, uh -huh. FT, Falcon Trail. And so this is the trail. And so now if they would have had that back, back there. there on a tree where everybody could see it, then we would know, hey, wait a minute, there's the Falcon Trail there. A little deceitful. I don't want to say deceitful, but just deceiving. And so I don't think they really thought about that when they put that one barrier up. And so, but at any rate, just things that you come across. And so we do have a place to replenish our water at the park. There's a, a bathroom so I can get water there if we had to do the 10 and a half, 11 miler. And so, but I think we'll just call our son and have him retrieve those keys in my car for her car. This right here is what they should have had yeah. at that junction. I remember this area. Yeah, if they would have had this here, we would have been all right. <laughs> yeah, there's a, there's a road right here. And so I remember this from last time. Yeah, I so now, guys, we're coming out of the woods. Though we were walking it the other way last time. Remember? We started at the park and we walked back this way. Is that what we did? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. We ended at Piper. I don't remember. It seems like. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know why I'm thinking we started at the. I'll have to watch the video again just to make sure. Huh. Any rate, we're starting to we're going to come out of the woods for a little while, and uh, we'll be back in it again. Um, but you get a little bit of everything, a little bit of everything on the views, and the trees are just gorgeous. I mean, I mean, talk about a slice of heaven here. I mean, it is just beautiful out. You can see the moon up here. See it it's mm -hmm. way up in there. Yep. Gorgeous, absolutely just beautiful. And here we are, crossing the road. I will say, once you're, if you're, when you're on the Falcon Trail, they have it well marked. Mm -hmm. They did do a good job with that, I will say. They make sure you know here. Yeah. Richfield City Limit. It's the first one of these I've seen on the trail since we've been on it. And you said we've walked how many miles so far? I'll tell you. 2.4? Yes. 2.4 so far? Uh -huh. Okay, almost two and a half. Here's some type of little camera here. Anonymous visitation counter. And so I guess every time you cross it, maybe it takes a picture of you. I don't know, but that's the way, that's the area we came from. And, uh, we should be getting to the park here real soon. We can't be too far from it. There's a really nice, um, what do you call it? I've got, I call it a, a swinging bridge. Suspension bridge. And so they got a real nice one out here at the park. And a what? Oh yeah, they got a nice little covered bridge out here also. Yeah, this is the park here. Yeah, those trees are beautiful. And there's the covered bridge right here. 
just enough to get your self through it. They're what? Okay. All right, how about y'all? It is gorgeous out here today. <laughs> and here we are. Sandra, step. My scale model. This thing's cool. Yeah, it's a good size bridge here. Yeah. And there's the uh, covered bridge where I just walked through just a minute ago. Now that's where the trail is. It keeps going that way. I'm gonna double check my map before we leave here because Sandra is going to depart from me at this point and my son is going to pick her up so we can get the keys to her car and then she we found out that they're doing a blood drive here and they're paying they're paying $20 a pop and so I know she's going to do it. I don't know if I'm going to do it. And so I'm one of those guys that tends to be a little weakish in that one area. If they lay me down, I might be able to. And so, but $20, you said they're giving you a gift card, $20 gift card. And so they did it at the right spot here at a college. A lot of kids need a $20 gift card. Yeah, if we both do it, it's forty dollars. Uh huh. All right, guys, this is where I am on the map, and I am going to get back on the trail. I'm splitting off from Sandra here. Going to give her the water bottle, and I will see her at some point in time. So, uh, at any rate, I think is that Austin coming now? Yeah. Is that him? He's in an SUV. Yeah, that's him. Okay. That's him. All right.